Fortunately, right now, a lot of people across our country are dealing with poor air quality, and it's all because of the wildfires there in Canada. So experts are advising limited outdoor activities or moving them indoors. In New York, schools have gone remote today due to the pollution, and more than 75 million Americans are under air quality alerts, including us right here in Georgia. Now, for most of the country, it is because of the wildfires, but as Rodney Harris has been telling us, uh, for us, it's more so uh, the ozone. Yeah. And Lana, what I want to point out is that uh, this is normal for us, believe it or not, in the summer, but it's very important uh, that you know, because there are a lot of air quality alerts associated with the smoke, that ours is not associated with the smoke. Now, the impact will still be the same, and you can see we basically have this cold orange over all of metro Atlanta. If you have lung issues, you want to avoid being outdoors for long periods of time, especially in the afternoon and early evening when the temperatures are the hottest. We're talking to the elderly, those of you who are kids or who may have asthma. Just a heads up this afternoon, this is not the first code orange that we've had so far this year, and it won't be the last. We get these a lot over the summer, typically because of the heat and the ozone. So that is in effect today, but again, this is not associated with those uh, Canadian uh, wildfires. They had code red air quality alerts up in the north and east. We'll keep you up to date on that uh, throughout the course of the day.